In Tyler County, people are still trying to recover from flooding happening just a few weeks ago that caused major damage. Now, areas south of Woodville off Highway 287 are preparing for even more flooding. KTRE's Shakina Davis has more from One East Texas Church in Warren. Located off of 4755 stands a Tyler County Church. The Seventh Advances Church has been in Warren for 40 years and never had any issues with flooding. On April 16th, they experienced their first flooding. Monday was their second. There's considerable damage in the church, and it's, uh, it's mainly from the first one, but the second one didn't make it any better either. Warren Seventh Day Advances Church pastor Steve M. says the building is not usable at this time. Every Saturday, uh, we worship here in the morning. Uh, we used to at least. Now we are kind of like looking for a new place to uh, worship. Sometimes we actually do worship, worship in the back. M says without flooding insurance, he's unsure if they'll be able to rebuild or relocate. So we're very, being very prayerful and considering all our options. Uh, but what we do know is that we don't think this is going to be a one-time instance. He hopes they'll receive assistance from the state, but at this time they're finding a temporary space. We will continue to worship every weekend um, as you know and wherever this path takes us we're going to go out in faith. Shakina Davis KTRE East Texas News 9. Tyler County emergency management teams are still on watch and alert as weather conditions progress.